some super quick things before we get into the video. First, I'm gonna assume you have a model, I'm gonna assume you have an armature, and I'm gonna assume you know how to weight paint. If you don't know those things, this video is still useful to you, but you just might not be able to use it right away. Tuck it into your back pocket, come back later when you need it. All right, let's get into the video. All right, fastest blender tutorial known to man. One, two, three, go. Uh, you need three things to make sure this works. First off, your model has to be perfectly symmetrical. And by that, I mean your vertices have to be perfectly symmetrical on both sides of the model. That should be the default if you followed an industry standard way of doing things, which is to sculpt your model in sculpt mode, then to retopologize by hand, and then to cut your model in half and mirror it to the other side. So if you have a model that isn't symmetrical, just go ahead and cut it in half and mirror it to the other side. That's not in the scope of this video, though. You can probably find somewhere else to tell you how to do that. Now, after everything's symmetrical, you need to make sure your armature is symmetrical as well, but also not just symmetrical. It needs to have a symmetrical naming convention, which means that in Blender, everything on the left side of your model either has a dot L or a dot R in the name. If you do it in X symmetry mode, the opposite side of the model will automatically update the dot R or dot L. That's really important for a lot of things, specifically what we're about to do. So we go to back to object mode. We select our, let's, let's focus on the head just for this little tutorial. We'll select head and then we'll click armature with control, roll P to parent with automatic weights so we can see how jank it is. And then we'll select armature and then head and then we'll go into weight paint. And now, Select like the bones, they're ugly, they suck, they don't like it. So we have to edit things, and you're always going to have to edit things whenever you use automatic paint weights. And if you don't use automatic, you have to do everything by hand anyway. So if we want to mirror things, we need to hit in to open this menu to the right, and go to tool, and then under symmetry, we want vertex groups x symmetry. We don't want to use mirror modes. They don't do what you expect them to, in, or what you'd want them to. Vertex groups X symmetry will make it so that everything that's named correctly will go ahead and mirror to the opposite bone whenever you're painting. Just like that. That's it. So now all you have to do is go down one side of your model and fix everything, as well as, you know, the singlet bones so that don't have a symmetry axis. Uh, and that's really how easy it is. Uh, it's nightmarish to find this information online because Blender changed where this option is three times the last three versions. Anyway, thanks for watching. If it helped you at all, please leave a comment, like, and subscribe. I make variety content. This won't be all tutorials, and I hope you stick around.